Aerodynamic jump is a, uh, a subject in long range shooting that's, that's talked about a lot less than like Coriolis or spin drift. Basically, aerodynamic jump is the vertical deflection of a crosswind. Um, most ballistic solvers don't correct for it. Uh, the applied ballistic solvers do uh, calculate aerodynamic jump and apply it to your solutions. It's a subtle effect, but it's there where it's most important is when you're doing a ballistic calibration. You know, when you're truing your ballistic solver at 800 yards, for example, trying to get, determine what your muzzle velocity really is. Well, if you're doing that in a 20 mile an hour crosswind, there's gonna be a significant amount of vertical deflection from that crosswind that's gonna get built into your solution as error, unless your ballistic solver accounts for it and apply ballistic software does account for that aerodynamic jump. So as far as hitting targets, the small amount of aerodynamic jump is usually not the decisive factor. Usually what's more important is getting the magnitude of the horizontal deflection to put you on target. Um, but aerodynamic jump is, it's a real thing. It happens. Um, it's the, it's what's responsible for the four to 10 o'clock slant of a group on a target. It's most evident at shorter ranges because the angle is more steep. At longer ranges, that angle flattens out. You can read more details about aerodynamic jump and applied ballistics for long range shooting.